How many people need to be in a room in order for there to be a 50% chance that two of them share the same birthday? Is it 100? 200? 365? Well, the famous birthday paradox states that given a room full of 23 people, there is a 50% chance that two people have the same birthday. But why is this the case? In today's video you'll be learning about why this statement is true, and why it actually makes perfect sense when you think about it mathematically instead of intuitively. In order to understand how this paradox works we must first ask a simpler question. What is the probability that you do not share the same birthday as someone? First let's say that you are in a room alone by yourself. What is the probability that you do not share a birthday with anybody in the room? Well it's 365 over 365 which equals 100%. This is because there are 365 days in total so we get 365 for the denominator, and there are 365 days that you could be born in, without matching anybody else in the room so we get 365 in the numerator as well. Now let's say that you're in a room with one other person. What is the probability that the two of you do not share the same birthday? Well there are 365 possible days in the year which you could have been born so we get 365 over 365 for your possible birthdays. Now, the other person can only have 364 possible days that they can be born in without having the same birthday as you. So the second person in the room is only allowed to be born on 364 out of the 365 days in the year, otherwise there will be an overlap between the birthdays. So the probability that the two of you do not share the same birthday is